Perseverance landed on Mars. The spacecraft left Earth over six months ago. The mission is to bl a blend of current events and science for our local schools. ABC 6's Garrett Short spoke with students and teachers about these events that will go down in history. Space travel has always amazed America, so it's no surprise to see the landing of the Perseverance on Mars catch the attention of the country. For teachers, big events like this help bring learning to life. I always try to find something that we can relate to from the outside world. Uh, and, and this is one of those moments, yeah. Ryan Kelly teaches science at Austin High School, and he said events like this really catch the attention of the students and allow some creativity outside of the ordinary curriculum. All of a sudden we get to talk about, hey, you know, these, these scientists are using the exact same stuff that we're talking about right now to send, you know, these things 120 million miles across the solar system onto a you know, alien planet. Touch on confirmed. However, Kelly says not all of his students were even aware of the landing, but it does serve as a good teaching tool and as a relief from some of the more serious things happening in the world. Anything that's that brings out uh, those those things that bring out the good in the world that that uh, that kids can see as uh, just just something that gets away from the, the heaviness that they're seeing around them right now. For sixth graders at Southwest Middle School in Albert Lee, they've enjoyed getting to learn about space alongside this rover mission. It's really interesting, I think. I think it's going to be really cool. Like, we get to tell our grandchildren one day, maybe. And for young students, Thursday is a sign of optimism as the country pushes the boundaries and learns new things. Our technology will get different and we'll get different resources and different sources of energy and different like materials to build these things and we'll know about the atmosphere. As for being the people to go to space one day, they have mixed feelings. It'll be fun because you know you're in a new environment. I don't think I'd be brave enough to work as an astronaut. On Earth, Garrett Short, ABC 6 News.